both accomplished artists in your own right, in your own mediums, in your own interests. How did you begin this process of collaborating to create? I, I actually, I, I'm going to start, Mark, because I remember <laughs> the sort of the, the beginning, and that was because uh, Mark hired me in Texas at, at the University of Texas, El Paso, and uh, when I saw his work, I thought he should make prints <laughs> because of the this sort of scarification and the digging. Mm -hmm. And so I said, Mark, let's you make a print. Mm -hmm. Yeah, let's do it. So we started, I, it started out more me being the printer and him being the artist that I was printing for. Yeah. And and Mark, correct me if I'm wrong, but at, at one point he goes, why don't you do something yeah. to this? Mm -hmm. And suddenly that that's was, where it started like 20, like 20 some years some of your imagery on top of this. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Really? Said, yeah, I'm not precious about it. Yeah. We're making lots of them, he did, and I said, yeah, I kind of like your fussiness versus yeah. that. And then, well, why don't we do a series, you know, for you know, I mean, and I like Kurt's work to begin with because I hired him. Mm -hmm. So it was like I had this, some connection, affinity. affinity somehow, but it wasn't my work at all or the way I worked. It was mm -hmm. like the opposite end. Mm -hmm. So it's like, and, and a lot of, we're not the first people to collaborate, and a lot of people have collaborated. We've been doing it for a lot of years, so. And I've done it with poets, and I've done it with some other people. But uh -huh. generally, it doesn't work that well because mm -hmm. it, it's like I think it has to come from two. You have to have something in common and something really opposing. Mm -hmm. You know. It, so what do you have in common, and what do you have opposing? I, I think it's um, something primal. His more for imagery. It's kind of primal imagery, and mine's the actual mark making, like cave marking. You know. Mm -hmm. So there's something. Mm -hmm. His is developed into a more narrative association. Mine's kind of like the scratching and the digging and the excavation. But I think the two things are both come from that same melting pot of mm -hmm. kind of, uh, yeah. That primal. Primal yeah. feel. Mm -hmm. And then the opposite is that he's very particular and very specific and very, you know, anal. And I'm very kind of aggressive and very spontaneous and very uh, out there. So yeah. the two, both in terms of how we work and what we want to talk about, uh -huh. it, 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 it comes together and then it separates. Yeah, and I think it's interesting because the separation takes place when I start to draw more like him and he starts to draw more like him. Uh -huh. Because uh -huh. you just do, you just, you're influenced yeah, because you're yeah. working. And I, I mean, I had an oil painted since I was in undergraduate school, but when we worked on the last thing, I actually was painting with a brush. It was just mm -hmm. like suddenly, it was it was there and we are in this studio and painting. And it's, it's not that we quit because I was painting or anything like that, but I, you kind of know when to say, okay, back, so mm -hmm. that you sort of recharge your battery and come back to the collaborative. Collaboration. I think it's also the ability, the, the thing that works is to kind of push down the ego. Mm -hmm. You mean you just have to know, it's like he's going to tear this apart. It isn't, an apart. Easy thing to do it isn't. as an artist, I mean, you kind of stand on that sometimes when you're by yourself. And I can't, honestly, I mean, I'm trying to think back the number of years we've been working, but very, very seldom, if ever, I can't honestly remember an occasion where he's done something to something I did, where I was like offended or like, no, stop or yeah. anything. I mean, if it ruined it in my eyes, it was like, okay, now I'll just go back and do what I think it needs mm -hmm. done to it. So it's always, Kind of a love me, love me not, love me, and mm -hmm. usually it fits even like the works that are up there. It's like there's some that are more Kurt, some that are more me, some that are he, he kind of pulled the plug, sometimes I did.